I'm sorry, I'm sorry, they're looking good. Hey. As you're about to say, Sarah, I will be installing the fuel pump. Uh, if you watched the last video, you seen that I put the pulley on the car and the injectors and the spark plugs. Actually, for the injectors, I actually have to wire these this harness onto the regular wire. Like, as you see, this is cut. I don't know if y'all can see it, but this is cut, and I have to wire this onto this because it's a different connector. I don't know. I should just got the adapter. So if you're getting these fuel injectors, just get the adapter that you could have got, that I could have got. I did not do that. But we will also be installing the fuel pump in the trunk. I'm gonna show y'all all that. If you are new, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and we just gonna get on with this build. So, like I said, I gotta cut all these wires. This is the fuel pump, by the way. As y'all see, using the heat gun to got down on this, what is this called? Heat shrink. Speaker. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, they're looking good. Hey. I'm telling y'all, just get the adapters. Literally. Just, um, get haunted. Hit just that bit. Just wired all the uh, connectors. Now I'm just using the heat gun to basically seal the wires. Um, And then after this, I'm going to put the uh, fuel thing back over and we're going to start the fuel pump. The fuel pump should be interesting because uh, y'all going to see. Some people was asking like I should get into racing. I'ma see um what this car does after this tune and then we shall see. You did pretty good on this out. Yeah, it looks professional, don't it? It actually does, like unless you've been sarcastic. It looks pretty good to me. Yeah, I know. I was shocked. Rick, you did that? Boy, you stupid. <laughs> Nah, for real, it is tough. Look at the details. It's a bit hard. I'm gonna leave Reek's um, Instagram down in the description if y'all need supercharged lids done. <laughs> this guy there? Oh, snap. Hold on, not be easy with that gasket. <laughs> Take it easy. You finna stand on it? What up? He's going outside. Like this one. This one. That lane, boy. Are you not running a, a intake anymore? Oh no, we have to. Um, we can't do the intake no more. It just has to do it like that. Makes sense. Make more power. More air. More air. <laughs> that big gonna be breathing like three behind the camera. No. <laughs> Fuel pump finna go in there. Big E85. If y'all see Reek stranded, he just need gas. Not for real. I know what's wrong with it. Ain't got no gas in it. Dang. Nah, no. we are done with the engine. You know all this. You stuff. forgot to connect this adapter. Um, I sure need it. Who need know where to go, y'all? It goes. I mean, I should have did it before we put this on. So yeah, this is. Whoa, 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 whoa. Right there. If you come up here, this is where. Oh my God. What is this nonsense? This is your fuel pump, right? Right here. Um, now how we take it off? I don't know that yet. Um, yeah, I don't know that yet. But I'm going to get a vacuum because you don't want this to drop in your um in there. So I'm going to get a vacuum and suck all this up. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna solve that. Oh look, how handy. <laughs> this 
this is the kit it come with. This go in the trunk. I'm gonna show y'all more clearly, but this. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Okay, four. My phone right here. This is the wiring harness, and they both um, are ground wires. So you're going to put that. Um, you're gonna put that right here for the ground wire and stuff. And yeah, after after I install that, I'll turn you back on. I'm gonna need that bolt and unscrew that. About to sell middle middle. Yeah, something like that. Sell middle Some middle. Sell middle middle. Is it? It is. So there, I'm unscrewing the ground wire. Do yeah. both of them go right there? Yes, they do. They both go right here. Um, that ain't too much ground. Another ground. Hey, it's another ground way over here, big bro. No, it's not. Yes, it's, it is. No, it's not. That says battery. <laughs> Major look. Get your positive one. That is gonna go in here. The positive cable. Bust! <laughs> you scared me, boy. It's supposed to be like, yeah, we finna blow up, my boy. What? I thought it was over with. <laughs> Comment down below, y'all got scared, cause I know y'all got scared. Too. I think I jumped. <laughs> so you're going to unplug this right here. It's in the on the other side. I don't know that you gonna get this Y connector. Where'd it go? I think it's this. Into this. Oh, wait, did I count? Cause like this is not coming in, so it gotta be. This into this. Yeah. So you're going to feed these two lines up through where the fuel pump is, and you can just follow the uh, factory fuel pump. So just go under this, basically, and then through the trunk. Feed it through like so, like this. Um, what kind of tab is that? Oh, you go this way, sir. This. You ain't hitting that bit for real, bro. You gotta whack that bit. So we got it off. Um, I hope there's no gas in here. Uh, bro, how is there gas in here? Hmm? How is there gas in here? Mm -hmm. Give me the vacuum, though. Like the little, just, just, just bring Stanley over here. Hey, right, Stanley. You need more? I just need to turn on. Oh. 
it, bro. You gotta take off that other one. Huh? Don't you gotta take off that black one right there to your left? This? No, to the left. Oh, it's on. That's on. Oh. Okay. I can try to take all this gas out, but highly doubt it. So now that you got the fuel pump out of the car, you're going to take this and you're going to remove these top screws. This should come off. Make sure you have all the um the rubber pieces, I mean, you have like these seals, make sure they're around the, the, the right place. Then after that, you are going to remove this, not this one, this one bolt right here. You take that tab off, you're gonna come to the old pump and take it off of this. There's a tab right here that you push and it slides right off. After you get all that installed, you want to basically just drop everything back in place. But it's gonna go first. Actually gonna um don't put this plate on yet put it on after because there's some things that you have to um that you can't see nothing so with it like that make sure all you you have all your seals on there your rubber seals and you're gonna get basically the fuel lines and just attach them the black one just goes literally in that silver this silver piece right here, that's where the return line is gonna go. Like so. So, just got the pump installed. Um, it was kinda hard. You might need somebody to help you with the pump because you can't really see, like, cause you have to have this off to connect the um, fuel line, so, um, yeah, to put it on, you can't really see it because it's the actual pump not gonna come out, so you can line the holes up. So you're gonna have to need you gonna need someone to hold the pump or do something, whatever y'all figure it out. But yeah, you definitely gonna need something. Just installed the pump. It's actually in there. Um, I just have to connect it to the um, connectors back there. Put the seat in, and then that's gonna be it for this install. If you enjoyed today's video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure y'all stay tuned because I will actually be getting tuned um, in the next video and going to pick up E85 in the next video. So make sure you tune into the next video, see the process, see the, act, the cat actually come alive. Like literally, like let me show y'all. Like we actually put this bit together. Green belt, pulley, spark plugs, injectors, long tube headers, intake, Fuel pump, 180 thermostat, and that is this build for this cat. Make sure y'all also comment down below a name for the cat. I don't really know. I seen some say, like, I don't know what they were saying, but make sure y'all, like, yeah, I need a name. Maybe y'all can wait until y'all see what it sounds like to give it a name, but this is actually the, um, the, uh, uh, what I came up to do, so yeah, that hard. We just gotta put the cow back on. And yeah, that's gonna be it for literally the build, actually. So make sure y'all stay tuned, like I said, for the next video. And yeah, ask comment, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. All that, it's gone. I just need your love, be there when I fall.